See, I, I wanted to say the Hellcat, but you can't get those with a manual gearbox anymore. And you can't get the GT500 with a manual gearbox. What about the 350? They don't make the 350 anymore. Uh, you want to stand on top of his home or? So now we're going to discuss the top five sports cars that you can get for over 55,000 that you can still get with the manual gearbox. And it has to be your do everything sports car, right? All right, you want to hear my list? Yeah. All right, for over 55,000, the, in the fifth spot will probably be See, I, I wanted to say the Hellcat, but you can't get those with a manual gearbox anymore. And you can't get the GT500 with a manual gearbox. What about the 350? They don't make the 350 anymore. Oh, okay. But some of the some of the, the Mach 1s are over 55, so we can put the Mach 1 in, in them. Right? That's an awesome car. And for me, I would say number four on that list would be the Camaro ZL1. That's, yeah. <laughs> That's definitely number four. And number three, number three on the list. Ooh, this is, is good. It's getting tough now. For over 55,000, number three would be the BMW M4, right? I forgot the manual. Yeah, yeah, you can get the M4 in the manual. And number, so what was that? Was that four or three? I think that was number four. All right, oh, this is tough. All right. Or no. So, oh, oh, let's go over that. So, so far you got, you got the Mach 1 is five. Oh, yeah. And then we have the ZL1 is four. And the BMW. The BMW M4 is number three. So then number two is going to be the Porsche 911. Porsche 911 that you can get with a manual gearbox. And then to me, the number one car that you can get. Oh no, I actually know. I gotta redo my list. I just started something. I just started something, okay. I'm gonna push the, the Mach 1 off the list, right? And all right, so number five on my list is going to be the Camaro Z01. That's the number five car for over 55,000, right? It would go higher if you could, because it has to be a do everything car, right? So that's number five. Number four is going to be the, what was it? Did we say it was the BMW M4? Yeah. All right, so that's the number four car on the list. And the number three car on the list is the Porsche 911 Turbo. All right, or, or, or no, I don't think the Turbo comes with the, with the, oh, actually, yeah, I think you still get the Turbo with the manual. Or the Porsche 911 in general, right? So that's what, number three? Number two is the BMW M3. Right? And you wanna hear what the number number one car that you can get for over 55,000 um, with, with the manual gearbox that's gonna be a do everything car? The Cadillac, uh, I think it's the CTSV Blackwing. The Cadillac, CT, so CT5, CT5V Blackwing. The Cadillac CT5V Blackwing. That car, it, I know, dude, that, that's why I was like, I have to redo my list because I just remembered. That car has more horsepower than the ZL1, four doors, and you get a nice, wonderful Tremec manual six-speed gearbox. I didn't know they came in manual. <laughs> that's, that's the party, that's the party favor with that car, you know? So, that's, that's my list for the 55 and over. Do you have anything that you want to add on to that list? 
No, the the vets, that would have been a good choice, but they only make them in automatic now. Would be nice though. Huh? I don't think I have anything on Yeah, I think that those are the only Oh, bird just pooped. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, that sucks. So yeah, so that's our, our, our list for cars that cost fifty five thousand over. Does it does that work for you? I wish they don't make the R8 in manual anymore. Now, if we're talking used cars, that's a whole. Then we could go on for a long time. Used cars, you gotta make a three different lists. Yeah, we gotta make a whole different list of that. But we'll do that in a whole other episode. So we'll go over used cars, but for new cars that you can buy in 2022, how do you feel about that list? Yeah, pretty solid. All right, all right. So that's our list for the best sports cars you can get for over 55,000 that you can still get with a manual gearbox that can be your do everything sports car and you can still buy them new in 2022 comment below let me know if you guys agree if you know of any other car that you'd like to add to that list let us know and that's all we got to say about that you got anything you want to add all right like you said that's it so race car friends out what a little crab in the rocks here let's see how close you'll let us get <laughs> That's kind of cool. All right, you ready? All right. You want to stand on top of his home or? Uh, no. Why? Uh, for real? What did he do? That didn't sound right. Off my toe. Huh? I wanted to try to take off my toe. Did he really? All right. I guess we'll keep you at a safe distance. And I'm the one in props, but it's all good. <laughs>